Hey everybody, it's Brandon again. Hope you're all doing good. I've got a quick video for you today for people who might be using Linux applications on their Chromebook or on Chrome OS Flex. So the situation is you have a Chromebook, you have Chrome OS Flex, you decided to activate Linux on it, maybe using one of my awesome tutorials on the matter, and you've installed some productivity software like a Inkscape or a LibreOffice or something similar, and you're going along messing with it and you notice, hey, I want a custom font. So you go online and maybe you go to Da Font and you download the first one on the list there called Coffee Fills. Extract it and double click on it. Wait a minute. What do you do? You can't install it. Oh no. Well, luckily it's easy to get custom fonts working on your Linux applications in Chrome OS. So here's what you got to do. Let's open a new uh, window here and go over here to Linux Files. And the first thing you got to do is click on the menu and go to show hidden files. And this will bring up all the stuff that's actually there that you can't see. You're going to find a folder that says dot local. Open that. And there's one called share. Go in there. Then you'll find one called fonts. As you can see, I've already installed a few fonts on here on mine. You just take your font file you extracted. You drag it into that folder. Simple. Now if I, uh, let's open up an Inkscape, for example. Make a new document. And let's get at our text tool, if I could find that. And as you can see on the side, Coffee Fills. There's our new font we downloaded. Somewhere there's an Apply button, but my fat head's covering it. Just move me out of the way. We'll click on Apply. Oh, wait a minute. Where am I at? Coffee Fills. That's where I want. And there we go. I don't know why it's uh, looking so thick right there on this font. Oh, I think I probably know why. Let me move me out of the way again. I think I have a text stroke on. Let's turn that off. So anyway, there you go. Easy to get custom fonts working on any of your Linux applications on your Chromebook or on Chrome OS Flex. Now, just as a little bonus, because there wasn't really much to this video, I created a uh, web application it's called Font Inspector. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to open a new Chrome window. It's at fontinspector.ape/apps.com. You can also install this as a web app, which I've already done, and it give you, gives you its own window. And with this Font Inspector, you can uh, go ahead and load up any true type or open type font and look at every glyph that's in the font. So say you're a developer and you're using an icon font like uh, Here's a material icon that's used for a lot of Google applications. You can look at all the glyphs that are in that font. You can copy the code on it for using it in your web applications. You can save it as a PNG or save it as an SVG. So anyway, it's just a neat, fast little tool I put together for working with icon fonts or uh, any other kind of fonts. As you can see, we can uh, load up that one we just downloaded and see all the symbols that are in that font. So that's Font Inspector. That's how you install fonts for your Linux applications on your Chromebook. Hope you found this useful. If you have anything else you want me to take a look at, let me know. Otherwise, hope you all have a good day. Goodbye now.